What's everyone? It's me, Ashton Kamian. Let's talk about Ukraine war. Hey guys, this is me, Ash here. Hope you guys are having a good day, good night, good morning, where you guys are at. Hope you guys are enjoying my videos. Hope you guys enjoyed my last video of with the donkey. And I did, it was really good. And well guys, I will tell you guys some breaking news in Ukraine war. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. And yeah. Um, sorry if I burp. Um... I'm trying to think. Oh, yes. Um, you guys may have heard sometime last month, I think in September, early, early September, beginning of September. Um, unfortunately, Ukrainians have lost a, you guys may know the plane called F-16. Yeah, Ukraine lost one F-16 so far. That is, that is no good. And so far, they have not lost any of them yet, or just set one. And yeah, no one don't know what happened to the F-16, and and the um, the pilot unfortunately perished. We no one don't know how the F-16 crash caused. And yeah, some people were speculating um, plane must have went down, was having issue problem. Two, it could be just um, um, the pilot um, asked that he make the plane go down. It could be pilot 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 error or some or it could be some other stuff and yeah we may never know sometime or two some people spent late the russians must have took it out somehow who knows who knows or some people believe it was just an accident with the anti-air offense because people are saying about they're using f-16 for for not not actual combat perfect we meant for combat for taking out uh, missile drones and also um rockets from from cruise from different ways of how the Russians are using and yeah you guys may know they've been using a lot of kamikaze drones hitting um, cities and also rockets and missiles by mostly by aircrafts and and other stuff just want to tell you the Russians um claim they said they they took it down that they did not say they claim when they were happy the f-16 has been down just want to tell you, and some people spent like maybe after this war is over, we may know the answer, or maybe not. We may never know, you guys. And yeah. Bad news is in the front. Um, um, there's a city called, um, 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 start with the V. Um, just want to tell you, bad news is the Russians are close to taking that city. And luckily that city has been holding for a pretty long time. Um, um, the battle lasted for 10 years, and and also right, the Russians started to start their full-scale invasion. They almost took over city. Oh, now I know it's called Vidadar. The city called Vidadar. Vidadar is almost taken over because up uh, north, you guys may remember the city named Atita got taken, and the Russian gained a lot more ground. Um, yeah, I think I know why because the Russian got more more um, upper hands up north than they did. And they're close to taking over Vitita. And yeah, just want to tell you. And it's no good for Ukraine. And yeah. Oh yeah, I will give the Ukraine a credit. They did a good job to hold out that city all costs. Because uh, they've been having artillery. Now the city is close to gaining Silkament. They're going to try to best back rate the city all costs. And I heard that ration is already happening a while ago. And yeah. And the city near Park Rose is close to gaining Silkament. I mean, I mean, not in Sokman yet. It's close to getting into the battle. And yeah, just want to tell you the Russians are gaining ground slow by slow when it was a stillmate a while ago, and luckily it, they finally got it. Ukraine must have put their force to hold the north, or to the Russians side to take a break from fighting, because I sometimes you gotta save up resources and gotta save up men to take a break. And now they decide to return to the assault. And yeah, Pak Rose gonna be in danger soon, guys. People are estimating it could, could come anytime. It could come probably in, my guess, probably in October. That might guess the battle will start. And yeah, we'll see, find out, guys. And yeah. You guys may have heard the news about Ukrainian president decided to go to America not too long ago. Decided to meet meet our other president with a T named Trump. And to Joe Biden. I won't get into the full politics. Just want to tell you, um... They're trying to make the peace treaty, try to make that how this war will end. And yeah. And really crazy. And yeah. Um, what else? Oh, yes. And you guys may have heard um, not too long ago, I think a couple weeks ago, or last month, 
or President Trump will assassinate again. Just want to tell you. And yeah. And also, I want to tell you, the assassin, um, the assassin, he was, um, um, oh yes. Some said he actually was, right, the Ukraine war started, um, in 2022, the invasion started. The guy, he wanted to join the Ukraine army, the foreign volunteer. Unfortunately, the Ukraine government checked on him, and there was actual video proof. He actually said he is not, he wasn't too fit for combat because he was getting too old. And they decided to kick him out. And yeah. And there was some reason why he wanted to assassinate our President Trump. Just wanted to tell you guys. Alright guys, to me, I shouldn't go out. And hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, let me know down in the comment section what do you guys think about this. To me, I think it's really interesting crazy how the front line, how, how a little bit of the, the politics, I won't get in full. And yeah, really crazy guys. And yeah. And people are predicting this war could end sometime next year. Hopefully. We'll see, find out. If if not, I'm going to still cover the war. And yeah. Alright guys, to me, action going out. And by the way guys, hit that like button. Two, hit that subscribe button. Three, hit that bell button when aware I make an awesome video. Be number, I'm not forcing you guys to do whatever you guys want to do. And you guys more freely to comment me anytime. And you guys have your choice. I'm not forcing you guys. I'm not a dictator or anything. And yeah, you guys can do whatever you guys want to do. And I'm going out. Peace out, you guys.